maybe I could hold my breath. Gee. This is the place, right? So where are those guys? And more importantly, where's my power source? I think I saw a saloon over there. Let's head over and ask around. There's the town saloon? Then let's mosey on in, see what we can find. Maybe wet our... Nexus destroyed by Kang. Helped by the Avengers, my sources tell me. Sure, they didn't know they were helping Kang, but that's not the point, people. Because the heroes beat the guardian of the Nexus man thing, Kang was able to blast it into fragments, enabling him to bring Chronopolis into a single time zone. That's good news and bad news. The good news is we can now get out of Manhattan and see if the rest of Chronopolis has a decent golf course. The bad news is now every creep in Chronopolis can get into our city and slug it out with each other to see who's worthy of facing Kang. Okay, Avengers, you broke it, so what are you gonna do to fix it? Hmm. Seems they've sent a team to the Old West to secure a power source to help boost a strange beyond Chronopolis signal of some kind. Playing no snap. What? You low down, dirty, cheating oh. swine. <laughs> now just hold on a minute. <laughs> Gamora! Give me your scanner. You two are supposed to be taking readings. Oh, yeah. I totally was, but then Drax found this place, and it had music and... And tacos. <sighs> we have to find a negative ion emitter. Your scanner should now pick it up. <laughs> now get out there and start searching. How does it work? See that blinky light? If it don't flash, you don't have it. If it does... Your blinky light lies. I do not have it. Outlaws! <laughs> what? Is that? That, my fuzzy friend, is our power source. I am Modok, the ultimate human machine interface, and more importantly, the law! Well, not in my town. Isn't that? Don't ask. This place gets weirder by the day. Bring it! Well, looky here. Got us some outlaws. 50,000 big ones to the first cowboy to put these criminals in chains! <laughs> Cowboys? I do not see any half-human bovine creatures. Huh. Guess looking for the emitter will have to wait. Excuse me, good folks, but did I just hear that raccoon talk? Oh, why am I always singled out? There's two aliens here as well, you know. Don't mind him. He's having a rough day. Oh, my apologies.
That's not gonna help my most dangerous woman in the universe reputation. Gizmo looks right up my street.
thought I was never gonna get paid. As much as I hate to admit it, Modok's force field is pretty strong. You're right. I reckon we'll need something special to take him out. I believe we have found something. Yeah, looks that way. Think that sword of yours can help us out, Gamora? Partners. But we can't get close to him unless... What's that on the balcony above him? Ah, what the heck happened just now?
We've lost the signal. What happened to Fancy Captain America? Eh, who cares? Probably mopping up the last bad guys. Let's find that emitter. I am Groot! Great. Okay, you guys keep searching. I'll go rescue the log. Agreed. We'll rendezvous back at the mansion. On Annie. We got us some villains to catch. We sure do, Kid Colt. <clears throat> Mind if I tag along? They just kidnapped my raccoon and his houseplant. Why, sure, sugar. If y'all don't mind sharing. Mind? Why, it would be my pleasure, ma'am. Hold tight, sugar. Ah! Oh, 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 no! You okay, sugar? Here, let me help hey. you. What? Whoa! Ow! <sighs> Glad you could make it, partner. Yeah, me too. This will be my first train journey in a little while. Ah! You more of a stagecoach man, huh? Uh, something like that. That way. Uh, sorry, I didn't catch your name before. It's Cope. Kid Cope. Folks know me as something of an outlaw. What? The Kid Cope? Wow! I've read so many stories about you, man. You know, I'm something of a legendary outlaw myself. They call me Star Lord. Uh, sorry? Oh? Well, that figures. <laughs> across.
exactly look safe. Careful you don't fall into those burning rings of fire, Star-Lord. Exactly my specialty. How do I get myself in these crazy situations? It's crazy. What are you talking about? Now, stand back while I lasso this doohickey. I don't think I want to do that again.
This is the end of the line for you, Kid Colt. It's funny, Corbett, because I reckon I'm about to stop you in your tracks. Ooh, train puns. Can I? No. <laughs> President Bear? Eh, yeah, never mind him for now. Get in that cannon. I got me an idea. Oh man, this is gonna hurt, isn't it? I don't like how this is going. Quit your yakking and hold still, partner! back. I just wish we'd managed to get that device before we sent it south covered in chickens. You mean this? Rocket, my man! <laughs> if you didn't smell like that, I would so kiss you right now. Okay, so how are we getting back? Aha! Uh -huh. Ah! Oh, oh, oh! Uh, no, 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 no.
we holding up out there? We don't have the strength to take the fight to Kang yet. Aye. And Kang Citadel be protected by a mighty barrier. Whoa! Heads up! Oh, oh, no. We got it! That end is radioactive, you what? genius! Hey, careful, you can't just... Look, big guy. If you couple your dynamic resonators with a sub-neutron accelerator... But that could lead to a lethal magnetic containment failure, which then... Oh, boo-hoo! You worry too much. Voila! One boosted receiver. Oh! Cosmo! Good boy! Are you calling from nowhere? Cosmo! Pick stop! Stop! Chrono! Distress call! Pretty late! Needed help! Pretty lady? Mm -hmm. Doesn't that dog live on that giant head of a dead celestial? <sighs> Something with that much energy could help us take out Kang's defenses. We're outside space and time, and I don't see a door into Chronopolis. No, Hank. But we could make one, using the nexus of all realities. I may have an ancient spell that could unify this energy and tear a hole into Chronopolis. Though I'd need to consult the tomes in my library. Neat idea, Doc. But that Nexus explosion was huge. Any remaining shards would have been scattered all across Chronopolis. It would take months to find them. Aye. Or mere moments. If we had the infinite sight of the mighty Heimdall. Asgard is out there, but it's not of our Thor's time. It looks practically apocalyptic. Then let us hope Heimdall still holds guard over the Bifrost Bridge. Okay, let's form up two teams and start to turn the tide on Kang. I pray that Heimdall and my father are safe. I've heard tell of much destruction in my homeland. Is it technically still your homeland? I thought this Asgard was from a different region of time and space. Wherever it's from, let's hope we find at least one version of Heimdall who can help us. 